Hello friends, welcome to CEG Academy. Today we are going to see the MCQ related with water supply engineering. So the first question, when the reduced level of the water source is higher than the reduced level of the consumer's place, water is generally supplied option A by pumping system, option B by gravitational system, option C both A and B, option D all the above. So the correct answer is option B by the gravitational system because the consumer place is lower than the water source. Next question, in the pressure supply mains, water hammer pressure is reduced by providing option A is Lewis wall, option B air walls, option C pressure relief walls, option D none of the above. The correct answer is option C pressure relief wall. Next question, turbidity of raw water is measured of option A suspended solids, option B acidity of water, option C BOD, option D none of the above. The correct answer is option A suspended solids. Next question, if the chosen diameter of the pipe is less than the economical diameter, so the options A cost of pipe will be less, option B head loss will be high, option C cost of pumping will be more than saving, option D all the above. So the correct answer is option D all the above. Next question, the expected discharge to be obtained from an open well sunk in the core sand is 0.0059 cubic meter. If the working depression height of the well is 3 meter, so the minimum diameter of the well is option A 2 meter, option B 2.25 meter, option C 2.50 meter, option D 3 meter. The correct answer is option D 3 meter. Next question, the process of passing water through beds of granular material is called option A screening, option B sedimentation, option C filtration, option D none of the above. So the process of passing is fine uh, material that is called option C filtration. So if the size of the material is very high, so that is a screening process. So then uh, the particles settle down uh, due to this gravity that is called sedimentation. So the filtration is the uh, process of passing the water to the granular material. Next question, for the prediction of future population of the city, the factor to be considered is option A birth, option B death, option C migrants, option D all the above. So the correct answer is option D all the above. So for the purpose of population forecasting, we can uh, consider both birth, death and migrants. Next question, methamoglobinemia or blue baby disease is caused due to option A chlorides, option B nitrates, option C nitrates, option D sulfides. The correct answer is option C nitrates. Next question, to control the growth of algae in reservoirs, the compound which is used is option A bleaching powder, option B copper sulfate, option C lime solution, option D alum solution. The correct answer is option B copper sulfate. Next question, a pressure conduit laid underground may not be subjected to option A internal pressure of water, option B pressure due to external load, option C longitudinal temperature stresses, option D longitudinal stresses due to unbalanced pressure to the beds. The correct answer is option C longitudinal temperature stresses. Next question, the bacteria which require free oxygen for their survival are called option A aerobic bacteria, option B anaerobic bacteria, option C flocculative bacteria, option D none of the above. The correct answer is option A aerobic bacteria. Next question, gravity conduits are generally in that form of option A canals, option B flumes, option C aqueduct, option D all the above. The correct answer is option D all the above. Next question, the main disadvantage of the hot water is option A greater soap consumption, option B scaling of boilers, option C corrosion and intrusion of the pipes, option D all the above. The correct answer is option D all the above. 
Next question, the formula Q equal to P minus K into 1.8 T plus 32 in which Q is runoff, P is annual rainfall in centimeter, T is the mean annual temperature in the centigrade and K is the constant is known as option A, Justin's formula, option B, Kosla's formula, option C, English formula, option D, Vermeulen's formula. The correct answer is option B, Kosla's formula. Next question, the bed slope in the slow sand filter is generally kept. Option A, 1 in 50. Option B, 1 in 75. Option C, 1 in 100. Option D, 1 in 200. The correct answer is option C, 1 in 100. Next question, the water level in the open well was depressed by pumping 2.5 meter and recaptured 2.87 meter in 3 hours and 50 minutes. The yield of the well per minute is option E 0.0033, option B 0.0044, option C 0.0055, option D 0.0066. The correct answer is option C 0.0055. Next question. Perched aquifer are generally found option A on the surface of the ground, option B below the surface of the ground but above the water table, option C below the water table, option D all the above. The correct answer is option B below the surface of the ground but above the water table. Next question Mostly used coagulant is option A chlorine, option B alum, option C lime, option D bleaching powder. The correct answer is option B alum. Next question, a centrifugal pump is required to pump before starting if it is located op option A at higher level than water level of the reservoir, option B at lower level than water level of the reservoir, option C both A and B, option D neither A nor B. The correct answer is option A at higher level than the water level of the reservoir. Next question, suction lift of the pump depends upon option A atmospheric pressure, option B water temperature, option C velocity of water in suction pipe, option D all the above. The correct answer is option D all the above. Next question, shredding is essential provided in option A strainer tube wells, option B cavity type wells, option C slaughter type wells, option D all the above. The correct answer is option C slotted type well. Next question The maximum permissible harness of the public supply is option A 95 mg per liter, option B 105 mg per liter, option C 115 mg per liter, option D 125 mg per liter. The correct answer is option C 115 mg per liter. Next question, the chlorine supply cylinders are generally kept at 38 degrees Celsius to 40 degrees Celsius to prevent option A conversion into catalyst, option B its form burning, option C its form explosion, option D none of the above. The correct answer is option A conversion into catalyst. Again we will see next video. Thank you.